Today we are going to learn about the carpal bones. The carpus is the anatomical name of the wrist which connects the radius and ulna of the forearm to the metacarpals of the hand. The carpal bones are the group of eight irregularly shaped bones. They are organized into two rows, proximal row and distal row. Metacarpals attaches to the distal carpal bones. In the distal row, the first bone is the trapezium, which is a rounded square shaped bone. The next bone is a trapezoid, which is shaped like a wedge. The larger bone in the middle of the wrist is the capitate. And the next bone is hamate, which is the bone under the pinky finger. In the proximal row, the first bone is the scaphoid, which is on the thumb side, which is a boat shaped bone. The next bone is lunate, which is a crescent shaped bone. The next bone is triquetral, which is a pyramid shaped bone. A small round bone which sits on the top of the triquetral is the pisiform. The simple mnemonics to remember the carpal bone is she likes to play, try to catch her. Where S of she stands for scaphoid, L stands for lunate, T stands for triquetral, P stands for pisiform. T stands for trapezium, T stands for trapezoid, C stands for capitate, H stands for hamid. To avoid the confusion between trapezium and trapezoid, which is more lateral, you can remember it as trapezium is by the thumb and trapezoid is by its side. If you liked my video, please subscribe to my channel, like the video. And keep the bell notification on so that every time I upload a new video, you will get notified. Thank you so much.